What's up guys, Zack Scott here playing Mario Plus Rabbids, the Donkey Kong Adventure DLC for the Nintendo Switch. As you might know, I 100% completed the base game of Kingdom Battles including the previous DLC and I'll be doing the same thing with this new update which by the way is rumored to be very long. Thanks to you guys, my channel has exploded in popularity lately. In fact, the first episode of Mario Plus Rabbids has over 3.7 million views thanks to you guys leaving over 33,000 likes. I would be thrilled if this video got anywhere close, so thanks in advance for any likes and comments you can give me on this series. Also, thanks to your support, we now have surpassed 3.1 million subscribers. That's incredible and I cannot thank you guys enough. I'll do my best to bring you even more awesome videos. Just leave a comment letting me know which games made you subscribe and which games you'd like to see me play in the future. Now, without further ado, let's play the new Donkey Kong Adventure DLC for Mario Plus Rabbids. Here we go. Okay, I guess everything's looking fine. There's a couple of rabbits. Okay. And, oh no. <laughs> There's Rabbit Kong. Oh, that's how it's all connected. We had Rabbit Kong, but we never had Donkey Kong yet, so. Here we go. Uh oh. He should not be messing with that. <laughs> Bit of a. S oh no. Oh no. He should not be messing with that. He's really messing it up. Don't look. Man, that thing is powerful. If it can suck in such a huge beast like Rabbit Kong, that thing is powerful. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Yeah, things are getting really, really mixed up now. Oh, Mario and Luigi are here, sounds like. Oh, along with Rabbit Luigi and <laughs> Rabbit Peach is still on her phone. Oh, she's got to get a charge. Low battery. Oh, she's just really going to mess things up. We would love to stop, but I think we're going to get involved. Oh, no. Whoa, it just disappeared. So Rabbit Peach, but Mario and Luigi are behind, and so is Rabbit Luigi. But, whoa, somewhere in another dimension. Oh. <laughs> oh no. That, that looks like the flux capacitor or something. Oh, she got separated from the main group. Oh man. <laughs> Donkey Kong can grab and launch an ally on another one to make him team jump. I gotta get back into the swing of things here, right guys? With Mario plus Rabbids. It's been a while. Watch out, little crab. Ooh, here we go. Oh no, where's the rest of the washing machine? Where are we? Marooned on a tropical island with no means of warping back. We have to reassemble and fix the washing machine by finding its missing parts. It's our only hope to get back to the Mushroom Kingdom. Oh, she, she, still, she, still, <laughs> she has her crown still. Look, I see some locals who I'm sure will be willing to help. I'll just need to sweet talk them. <clears throat> Pardon me, we are in need of your quaint assistance. Oh, look at those. Those rabbits have gone bananas. <laughs> she is not impressed. Oh, what? Oh, no. They got coconut guns. Oh, uh, here's Donkey Kong, the star of the show. Those, are, those rabbits are not happy to see him. There we go, Donkey Kong, ground, pound, and primate. Oh, she's impressed. Oh. Uh, is, is that, is that like rabid cranky? <laughs> We're just waiting. He's here. Oh, whoa. Yeah, that's his name, Rabbit Cranky. Ever Grumpy Rabbit. Nice. <laughs> Those teeth went in her mouth. Oh, there you go. She doesn't like that. 
Defeat all. Okay, we're in this to win this. Let's do what we got to do. Ah, the mighty Donkey Kong. Let's put those bulging biceps of yours to work against those these uh, tropical ziggies. Okay. Did you know you're strong enough to pick up most cover blocks and throw them? No, that's a new mechanic. That sounds really cool. Nice. You can also grab allies and enemies alike to toss them elsewhere on the battlefield. Oh, Rabbit Cranky. My sensors detect that your Boombo conceals some formidable firepower. Let's check it out. All right. Let's just let's just uh, let's just fight. Let's get right into the action here. Um, if we want to move, um, what do we do? If if I can actually throw these, and I and I I might I could move here, and then maybe oh no I can actually just pick them up right now. Can I? Okay. Then what? What happens when I pick them up? Okay, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's just. Uh, maybe I can move back. You think? Oh, and then and then what? Throw it? Yeah, let's do that. There we go. This is gonna be useful. I mean, maybe I won't take everyone out, but I want to see this move. Here we go. Oh, he rolled it up in a ball. Oh, and they have burn damage, too. They dropped some bananas, and they picked him up. <laughs> okay, well, that was pretty cool. And then, um, oh, wow. Can I also do other things? Okay, so I have the potassium pulverizer. And then what's my other What's my other move here? Uh, the classic. Okay, they're out of range for the classic. And then I have Harry Eye uh, when triggered. Uh, ooh, 20 to 30 weapon damage. Ooh, enemies within the range are drawn to Donkey Kong. Sure. Come on, let's play my, my Congos. Oh, jeez, they're really, oh my gosh. So now they're within range if I do the classic. Oh, wow. Impressive. Uh, so, uh, hi. Got the good old classic. I'm gonna hurt Cranky if I do this. I don't think I wanna do this. And let's, let's take a look at the bananas. Yeah, although I did bring them here, I feel like I should just go ahead and, and hit them with bananas. And they bounce. Oh, whoa. Three of them went off. That's very cool. Then she probably do her good to run into him. Run into him. Does she have all of her powers from before? I don't think so. Uh, but if I do this, then I can kind of get right here. And then probably just do another. So he's hit. He's hit. And then she... I might not even be able to use Cranky Kong's thing. Uh, but we'll, we'll see. Here we go. I'll just, I'll just use it. Boom. Critical honey hit right there. And then uh, let's just, uh, who else gets a turn? You do. Um, let's see, I can run into you and you're, you're gone. Wow. So we got a complete, very nice tactics for that first round. We didn't really get to see his bow in action, but we will. Battle clear, they didn't even get a move. There we go, fantastic. <laughs> All right, barrel of rabbits, perfect. We got some bananas right there. Oh, nice. Completion trophies. New weapons available. Visit the Battle HQ. Let's continue onwards and see where we end up. Nice. Hey, I remember you two. You were in the basement when Spawny put on the Super uh, super Merge headset. The Mega Bug must have brought you here instead of the Mushroom Kingdom. Regardless, we're glad you found us when you did. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I think I can translate. Dang blasted machine fell fell apart in the dang blasted sky. Dang parts everywhere. Well, dang guys, we gotta go find him. Yes, yes, we need to find that washing machine and its scattered parts. Can you draw us a map? He's like, I guess I could. Oh, he's pointing. That way. Oh, there we go. He says the barrel cannon can get us to the main island where the missing parts are. All right. Sigh. He says he wants to show us something. I'll take care of it. Let's go. Thank you, but we'll take it from here. I'm sure you have your hands full or waving your cane angrily at teenagers. <laughs> I don't mean to be rude. You're a great fighter and all, but I suspect you may slow us down a bit and... Oh, I don't think he's going to slow us down. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. He's spinning like a top. Malfunction. <laughs> oh, what the heck? What the heck? Oh, <laughs> wow. Uh, I I'd rather we got you a walking frame or electric scooter, but if this speeds things along, so be it. Nice. 
Okay. So he's... That's really cool. So he's going to kind of lead the way. Now, um, you know, like I, like I said, I've completely completed... <laughs> you know the the base game and all of its DLC until this thing came along so we're gonna you know explore some we're gonna try to do 100% complete this as well uh, I think I can and I was really happy when I did it before this looks like they have all new let's just see I just want to see what this is I, I kind of forget what the oh yeah so we yeah we're gonna have to collect new artwork new music all new models all that stuff um, so we're gonna have to do that I just want to take a look around this place real quick before we really get a move in here so if we go over here, I know he wants us to go forward, uh, but I really want to just check this out super duper quick just to see. What does this say? Hold on. What, what does this say? Oh, wow. Fast asleep while everyone else scrambles to get all the work done. They'll be of no use to us while they snooze. Okay. Interesting. So what's this? But well, here we go. So we did get a 3D model of Rabid Cranky. So these guys, are these guys the challenge guys? They might be something like that. They're asleep, though. At least I got a little thing. And then we're going to move on. And, uh... Let's see. So this is the Battle HQ. Just out of curiosity, I want to check this out super duper quick. I want to take a look at my team, especially her. So I guess she... I don't think she has her upgrades from before. Or, no, she does. She does. She carried them over. Or did, did she? Am I reading this right or wrong? I'm getting kind of confused here. So I have one point. Okay, I think, man, I think I, I think I kind of understand. I'm trying to figure this out. So we got, um, is it one point for each of them, each of them to spend? It could be. So this one's takes two. This one could take one. So no. Although her skill tree is here, uh, she does not have the things. Um, bumped up like she could so I'm gonna hold off on upgrading this until I until I get a better um, you know oh this this is the skill tree view there we go I'm gonna hold off a little bit I'm gonna take a look at the weapon selection here so I only have 600 uh, bananas so I don't know that it'll be a great idea to buy things yet I tend to wait until I get kind of weak before I start buying things so I just wanted to touch base check that out um, we can now head off over here uh, we probably have another treasure chest to get and again, like I said, if we're going to be going for 100% completion, we're going to want to go over here and get these. Of course, it looks like we can come here later. That's another 3D model. That's of Donkey Kong, now available in the museum. And these guys, again, are asleep. Yep. That's fine. So let's head over here. One more tunnel. I'm just getting acquainted with my surroundings, and then we're going to push on with the story. Um, oh, this is the washing machine that's broken. We can't get back until we fix it over here. Same situation. So... Um, who is this for, you think? This is another 3D model. Uh, no, it's not. Yes, it is. Uh, oh, Rabbit Peach, of course. So, yeah, basically our previous... This is a, this is almost like a standalone DLC, although it's not. You do need to, you know, complete a little bit of the original story before doing this, but... For now. Which way were we supposed to go? Oh, this is the... Yeah, this is where we were. I'm sure he was pointing us in the right direction. I just kind of missed out. There's a big door over there probably can't get past it let's head where they want us to head i think that's gonna make the most sense uh so let's do it let's launch off i just had to scope out my surroundings thank you for allowing me to do that so let's see what we have going on now because again this will be a hundred percent completion playthrough on some games i don't promise that but i do on this you guys have been so supportive of this series i really really deeply appreciate it thank you so much all right, so here we are here, and again, this is said to be like like half the length of the other game. So I mean, I don't know how many episodes we're gonna get out of this, but it's gonna be a blast. Hey, birds, let's go pick up some bananas. Excuse me, birds, and we're gonna be looking for puzzle pieces as well. So this is stage two. I don't know if if it's gonna be divided up into worlds or what, but this is stage two. Gas, pay washing machine part. Looks like an important one too. Quick, let's grab it. Oh, he looks like he's very interested in that. Perhaps too interested. Oh, he looks very upset that we are. Oh, don't you dare, collector, compulsive curators. Is he just gone or do we get to fight him? Get washing machine parts back. Okay. 
I think I can do that. So, um, let's see. Okay, so he's way in the back here. Ooh, jeez. These assailants are collectors. They steal anything shiny and metal, including our washing machine parts. We'll have to defeat the collectors to retrieve the parts. Quick, before another enemy picks them up. If we don't retrieve all the washer parts, not only will we be stuck here forever, but we'll void the warranty. <laughs> all right, let's find it out. Um, so, uh, you know, we could make use. Uh, let's see. Where are, uh, let's see. How many are there? Were there only three? If there's only three. We probably got. No, there's four, I think. So, oh, he has some parts. Who else has parts? So there are two parts here. Oh, no, yeah, there's four. These guys don't have parts, though. Okay, so, um, I can't really... No, I can. Hold on. What happens if I go through here? How many passes can I make through? I can do at least two passes and then end up here. But I don't think I want to do that. I think I want to be a little more direct. Uh, so, let's take a look at her. What, what, what are her options? Again, she doesn't have... Let's see, I could go through here. I could send her on the sidelines. That might be useful. I think. I want to deploy the explosive, you know, and I, I might want to... Uh, oh, I can actually hit her. That'll be nice. But if I... What if, what if I want to yeah, start this going? I could start this going off towards them. Oh, this could actually hit right now. I think that's going to hit right now, because that's going to go through the log... Okay, 30, I'll take that, that's fine. He's gonna run a little bit. And that might get him closer to uh, Donkey Kong. I don't know if I should put up a shield or what. Maybe. I do get another action, so might as well. Donkey Kong, now, if he moves this way, that puts him really close. Oh wow, I might be able to just throw that at him, oh my gosh. But again, I might also just, uh, well, I can do both, can't I? I can pick this up, and then I'm just gonna be here, and I'm gonna throw that at him, I think. Wow. I can't believe I can pick up all these type of blocks. Donkey Kong is OP. <laughs> no. <laughs> all right, and then, um, you know, I could uh, do, what, 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 what move is this? Hold on, let's see. I could throw the banana at him, obviously. <laughs> Uh, I could also do that, and then this will do 40, not quite enough, but it does bounce him, so maybe. Let me do the mag magnet groove. And with him right next to me, I might be able to bounce him. It may, he may not bounce, though. Well, that was nice. He's running again. Oh, man, he, he sure runs. He's back to his original spot. So Cranky is going to be an interesting character here. Um, we're going to see uh, targets out of range for the wood shop walloper. Barrel of fun. Again, out of range. I might just move. And again, I don't know. I don't know if this puts them in range. This is Stink Eye when triggered. Weapon damage. Enemies within a range fall asleep. Well, let's just kind of... Uh, can I team jump off of him? I don't know if this puts me in a decent here. I can jump over here then. That'll be interesting. Here we go. So he's going to team jump off of Donkey Kong. <laughs> and then I want to see what these weapons do. So that's a pretty heavy hit right there. That's a double combo. This will also do a lot of damage. Um, just kind of which one do I want to do? I kind of want to see what this, this crossbow is like. So let's do the double walloper. Wow. So yeah. A little bit lesser damage on the back. Stink Eye. I'm going to give him Stink Eye. There we go. And he's going to be ready to use that. Enemies get a turn now. I don't know if... Oh, he saw him. He saw him. Oh, nice. He got stuck by the honey. This guy only has seven left. This guy's going to be on the move. He might actually just attack him direct. Yeah. For 20 damage, that's okay. Oh, he's gonna attack Donkey Kong. Not so bad. All right, and then uh, oh, he's gonna attack Donkey Kong too. A critical freeze, darn! Donkey Kong's frozen. Oh, and of course, take. Okay, I hope I wasn't being too aggressive with my moves. 
But we'll see. So, Hero's gonna ch uh, He can move. He can probably move right into him. And then, um, I could go right here. And I could try to put him all to sleep. Oh, darn it. I didn't even think... I totally forgot he was doing that. Oh, man. Okay, I've taken so much damage. Um, let's see. Can I put everyone to sleep in here? This would be a good move to do. I don't know what will wake them up, but... Oh, uh, I don't know if this will be enough, but... Oh, that got him. Nice. Alright, now we're talking her. So, I could probably go through here. Um, oh, darn. I don't... Here, I'll just go behind him. Sure. I can hit him for seven. For sure. Like, no doubt. Uh, let's go for... Yeah, you're gone, dude. Alright. <laughs> got him. So, he dropped apart. Now, do I just go by and pick it up? Or do I... What do I do, you know? I don't know. Uh, no one's really in my heal range. Uh, Donkey Kong does get some movement, but I don't know how useful it's going to be. I don't know if I can just pick up the blocks now. I think I can maybe pick up the blocks and just throw it at him. That could be useful on its own. Can I go through here with it? Oh, yeah. I could go right here. And then I just want to throw this at him. Wow. Donkey Kong is really good. Look at this. Boom! <laughs> Hit him for 30 by just picking up blocks, and I can do the banana too. Wow. And he's stuck there, by the way, and he's asleep, technically. And I'm going to heal at least Donkey Kong. Might as well. Enemies get a turn. Uh, he's going to move and probably attack me directly. Oh, he got the... Oh, my gosh. He has two parts on him, though. What's he going to do? Wow, he is retreating. Oh, more people are coming out. I don't like that. Uh, I mean, it's part of part of how it's gonna go, but I don't necessarily like it. So, uh, man, okay, I guess I'm gonna go through here. Ah, uh, man, where is he? Okay, yeah, I, I guess I'll hide behind here. I know that puts me wide open, but maybe I can, uh, you know, do another do another attack on him somehow. I don't know if I have to like. Here, this, this should take him out. So, so you're gonna drop two parts. And if he does, do I just go over there and get him and that's that? You know, like, is that all that needs to happen? I really don't know. Huh. Well, here, I could attack him. That's a pretty good hit. I, I can then move into him for just a little bit of damage, then try to try to get out of here real quick. Um, at least the best I can. I, I do want to go get those washing parts. Washing machine parts, but I think it's just going to depend on what we can do. So Donkey Kong's way off. Um, he can actually probably he might be able to do a team jump off of uh, Cranky. No, I mean yeah, but no, I forget. What what did it say his team jump was like? I don't know. Is he throwing somebody instead of doing a team jump? Is that what he's doing? Oh, I think he's throwing somebody. Wow. Okay, sure, yeah. So, that, again, Donkey Kong is so, so cool. And we sure get to see what he's all about this episode. Look at that. It'd be funny, it'd be funny if he took fall damage, though. <laughs> he doesn't, but it would just be funny. Uh, and then I guess I'll give Donkey Kong uh, this maneuver here, Harry Eye. I don't know if he can see over the log or... Uh, I don't know. I can't really attack anybody right now, so we're just going to have to give the enemies their turn. So these two guys are coming up. They're not collectors, but they're gonna try to get over there, I think. Oh man, oh man, he was out in the open. I knew it, but darn. All right, and then is he gonna attack Cranky as well? Oh, he's gonna try to attack her. I don't know why he did that. Okay, so he's actually gonna have a shot in case they start moving and more people are coming out. I gotta go get those parts. Man, I gotta go get those parts. Uh. Here, I'm just gonna try. Man, okay. I know that this. Here, I'll just throw him over there. I know, I know, I'm gonna get hit twice. But I, I need you, I need you over there. There you go. 
That should help. And then let's see if he can just go grab these right now. Now, is that end it? If I just grab these, is that all I need to do? Or... That's it. Battle cleared. All right. That's a cool... That's a cool feature. Purloined play parts. There we go. 150 bananas. So that was stage two. And I don't know if it's stage two of anything or what, but we got another rune for that. Okay. So uh, that was really cool. So we got two washing machine parts. And uh, I guess we just be on the move right now. Again, if I end up, you know, skipping over some collectibles, I I'll always go back later and and get those. So I, I don't want you to think like if I if I fail to search for something that I'm, I'm completely missing out. What was this? What was it? There's an A or something. Something for me to press. Oh, wow. An octopus fetching something different for his underwater garden. Yellow is very fashionable this year. <laughs> yep. Okay. Um. Oh, wow. Whoa. What the heck? Did you do that, octopus? I don't think he would do that. I don't think he'd give that to me. All right. Well, let's uh, keep going here. All right. This is stage three. Here we go. Progress saved. Oh, boy. Rabbit Kong is here. He smells something. It's us. <laughs> I'm your counterpart. Join us. <laughs> She's not impressed. Oh, man. He's freaked out. He remembers. Oh, she toppled us. <laughs> so this is like a sequel almost. This is like a sequel without being like a direct sequel. Oh, my gosh. Is she okay? Is she okay? Whoa. <laughs> oh, jeez. What's gonna happen? Oh, Cranky's... Cranky. It's surprising. She's okay. But she's not happy. <laughs> Defeat all. Okay. These have some interesting, like, looks like almost like ramps up top. So let's see what we got to do. Now, now, don't blow your top rabbit, Peach. Rabbit Kong will get uh, what he has coming. Okay. That's true. He will. Gasp. Donkey Kong, check those fascinating surface formations. By hopping on them, you'll be able to leap forward at even greater distances. All right, well, we'll have to give them a go. There are lots of them on the battlefield. Leap across multiple gaps to increase your movement range. All right, let's fight. Let's look at our, actually, let's look at our battle HQ really quick. If I have some of these runes that I can use, uh, maybe it would be a good idea to use them. Um, uh, what do you think? So enemy throw damage uh, increases damage dealt to enemies upon impact after being thrown. So you can actually throw the enemies. I forgot all about that. Um, oh, grab enemy ears popping out of the ground and then throw enemies away. Can I just get that immediately? Holy cow, that would be fascinating. Um, wow, that would be really cool, actually. Uh, so this is high ground damage bonus. This is uh, just another damage bonus. Uh, this is uh, attack range for the primary weapon, which would be really good. This is the kind of stuff where you, uh, you know, can travel a little bit more. This is more health. Uh, man, I sure like the idea of being able to grab. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get this. Yes, that is so cool being able to grab their ears. Now, for her, you know, being able to do a dash a couple times, that's the default. I have that. Um, and also, she has the heal. But what are we talking about doing here with the dash damage? More of that, an extra dash. You know, which one do we want to? Which one do we want to focus on? I don't know. Uh, this is also cool. A cleansing jump could be useful. Um, I'm trying to remember how I, you know, had it before. I don't really remember. Uh, movement range, being able to move farther, I think is a good idea. Um, so I might go for that. And then I also might go for, uh, just go ahead and give us a cleansing jump. Now, Rabbit Kong, on the other hand, uh, if we're talking about, you know, the dash damage, the team jump range, cleansing jump as well, uh, that could all be good. Uh, but we, you know, this barrel bolt, we could do... Um, Let's see, cover damage bonus, weapon range bonus. We could give him a bigger range for his weapon. Why not? And then how about uh, maybe for him, uh, we could talk about 
um, increasing the, the range of the stink eye. Upgrading a stink eye could be really cool. And I think we can, uh, you know, redo those later. So let's just, let's just call it a day for now or whatever. Call it a night, an evening. Fight. Let's just fight. How about that? Oh my gosh, I totally forgot about healing her. Oh man, so yeah, she's gonna go right behind here and she's gonna heal. I totally forgot all about. Now, is she, is she hurt because of what happened? Um, let's just send him this way. All right. And then we're talking about healing herself, at least. I wish I would have given Cranky the healing jump, but that's okay. Um, now this is interesting because I do want to pick this up and I do want to kind of go over here. And I do want to throw, oh, I do want, I do want to throw it. I guess I have to throw it up here. Huh. I hope I don't trigger the explosive. Nice. Um, and then uh, I can't quite reach any of this stuff. I could do the jungle drums. To try to get these guys out over here. I call them jungle drums. It's like the magnet groove is what it's called. Hey, buddy. He looks a little scared to me, though. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's try this. Okay, I I blew that up. My bad. He's gone, though. That's good. All right, now now he on the other hand has some. Now he might be able to jump up here. I don't know if this is gonna be what we want to do or what. Uh, let's see. Well, okay. Here's here's what I want to do. I think I just want to move up a little bit. I think I want to play a little defensive on this one. I want to I want to see can I I can't reach anybody. Darn it. But I can give him this, the stink guy. This would be good in case they start moving. Okay. Give the enemies their turn. So there's this guy. This guy's going to move. He's going to get stink eyed. So that's good. Whoa, and he took vampire. Oh, he's moving for sure now. Okay, let's let's not be too hasty. What was that? I don't know what he just did. Oh, there's this guy up here too. Don't forget about him. Ooh, that block is gone. Okay. Oh, there's, I didn't see this guy up here. He's going to try to attack who? Donkey Kong. Ouch, a critical freeze. Oh, he's also going to do... Okay. Well, okay, so it's time for the heroes to make a move. I know that we're going to need to attack him, so sure. All right. And then, again, no one's really in the range. Um, man, I know that... Here, we can target both of these guys. Well, here we go. I'm going to target him. There we go. He's going to move close, though. Now, hopefully Donkey Kong can use this as an opportunity. I'm going to go ahead and give her a shield. I don't know what his plans are. Um, now, Donkey Kong could definitely use an opportunity here to... Uh, can I... Hold on. Can I move into it? I know I'm going to get hit again. Can I pick him up? Oh, my gosh. Okay. You know what? Sure. I know I'm going to get hit. Wow. Oh, he's... Oh, another critical freeze. Ha! He went out of bounds! Oh, he's back. Darn it. Well, here's some bananas for you. That wasn't very good, I guess. He's gonna... Oh, man. He's gonna come over here even closer. Oh, no. Man. Okay, nice. He's He's gone. That's good. Donkey Kong is taking a lot of damage, though, unfortunately. His sleep... He can maybe sleep him? I don't know. I could try to move, run into him, maybe, and then come back. There we go. That's not so bad. And then sleep him, sure. Uh, I don't really want to make a move with her. So let's give the enemy their turn. He's asleep, which is good. 
Man, what is going on with that move? I don't really understand it yet. Oh, that's gone. He, what happened? What just happened? Heroes get to make a move. Um, I'm going to definitely try to use this to the best of my ability. Um, man, how do I handle this? Man, I really don't know. Um, sure. That's so close. Okay. Here's my idea. I, I use this weapon against them. Wait, that's not gonna work. Okay, so I'm gonna move, okay, sorry. I'm gonna go ahead, pick him up. And then I'm gonna go ahead and move, I guess up here. Wow. I'm gonna move up here. And I'm gonna throw this Darn it. Um, can, I, can I throw? Where can I throw him? Can I throw him off the edge? <laughs> It'd be hilarious. Uh, I'm going to throw him. Uh, sure. You know what? I'm going to throw him like right. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. How about this? How about. I'm still trying to. I'm still trying to wrap my head around how this works. Okay. How about. I Okay, I can pick him up. I can then go up up here. Man, I can't throw him at anybody though that I want to. Okay. So, sorry, I'm this is taking me a long time. I can go over here. Man, I don't want to be on the open. Okay, sorry. Let's just think about this. Let's just do this. If they move close to me, they're going to trigger that explosive. Oh, gosh. That was bad news for him. But then I can maybe still uh, go over here. And man, I know I'm out in the open. I don't like I don't like being damaged so much, but it is it is what it is. <laughs> wow. Are they still both alive? It's okay. I think if I give him Harry Eye. Let's see what Cranky Kong can do. I think now Cranky Kong can take care of both of these. Perfect. Excellent. And he's without a, sh a shelter, so okay, let's go ahead and Give the enemies their turn. There's only one guy left. And, you know, he might shoot Donkey Kong. That's only 25. I say I say only. But still. Man, he's... Okay. Man. Um. Oh, wow. I can actually use this? Here, let's use it on him. That didn't hit him. Darn. Uh, what about... Man, okay. Let's try this. I'm gonna probably have Cranky Kong get hit with by that. There you go. So I know that this is overall risky. He's gonna get shot. But I want Donkey Kong to be able to go over towards him. I, I don't know. Here, I want Donkey Kong to just go up here. I know my health is really low. Nice. Did I get him? Is he down? Very cool. All right. I don't know, like, if there's like an ending to like a world, like what kind of sections it's in. But there we go. We did it. We did another perfect round. That was stage three. Nicely done. Let's continue onwards. 
<laughs> She's like the Tasmanian devil there. Alright, you know, when you said you wanted to show us something, you could have been a little more specific. Rabbit Kong, of all the... Uh, how did he even get here? And he looks so strong. He must have been working out. What are you saying, Cranky Kong? Or, uh, Rabbit Cranky? Cranky Rabbit? Rabbit Cranky? Whoa, what is this? Oh my gosh. What is this? Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is the story of how he got here, I guess. Yeah, he is big and bad. I would, of course, love for him to build another tower and then push it over, but... <laughs> it's like, oh, you, you have this. Oh, hit him in the head. <laughs> he can't control his rage. Whoa, what the heck? It was like an electronic banana. What the heck? And he ate it. Okay. <laughs> wow. Yeah, lots of bananas around. All right, we'll get to work, guys. So that's the story of how they got there, I guess. Whoa, so the main body of the washing machine is right in the core of the hideout of Rabid Kong? Way over there. Well, not, not too far. And it's guarded by an army somewhere beyond the, that giant gate that needs two keys to open? Wonderful. Doubtless, they're scattered far and wide, safeguarded by wicked brutes. Typical. We need to find those keys. Hurry. Uh, indeed we do. I, again, I don't really fully know. Um, like, does, do, do I have, here, let's see, do I have health right now? Team info, let's just look at the info. How do I? Okay, yeah, my health is restored. I guess she had low health because she was literally bashed into the ground. So that makes sense. Um, I'm trying to find a good break point for this. Let's move forward a little bit. That's a pretty intense battle that we had here. There's something go. Oh, wow, I can walk over here. Well, no, I, well, I can, but I can. There we go. More bananas. So what am I on the prowl for exactly? Um... Any sort of alternate path. There's a little island over there. There's some crabs over here. I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing. Because I know that, you know, in the original, uh, th there are like sets of levels, and you got to do them all, and your, your health carries over to each of them. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, like if you take damage in like the first one, then you, you know, you get, you still have that damage in the second. And I thought that's what was happening, but I think. Maybe it was what was happening. I don't know. Aha, here we go. This looks like a nice little realm. I don't know. This could be the... Uh, they. You know what? They might just not number... Uh, they might just not number the stages the same way that they did previously. This gate requires two keys to open. Seems excessive, but remember, we're the tourist here. It's not for us to criticize. <laughs> All right. What was I looking at? Was I looking at something else? Nope, I was looking at the same exact thing. All right, so this uh, is obviously some sort of a puzzle. So let's see uh, what we can do with it. You know, part of this is exploration. Part of this is just, you know. All right, there's a treasure chest there. All right, so green. Okay. So that, okay. Yeah, I don't fully know what I'm doing yet. That's okay. We'll figure it out as we go along. Okie dokie. Um, this is a bridge that it looks like it's out. 
The rabbits left this pontoon bridge unfinished. We'll have to find another way. So it's not just out, it's unfinished. And then there's a red one here. There's a lot of treasure around here. It seems just re ready to be solved, this puzzle. Huh. Okay, it switched them, sort of. Which is fine, because we just need to get this. So we got a 3D model here. Oh, that's one of the, the, the torches lit. <laughs> I didn't realize we are lighting torches here, but I guess we are. And then, uh, is this the other way? Is this where we came from? It'll tell us before we're about to do a level, right? What am I looking at? Oh, nice, ooh. The lesson here is to never lie out under a giant magnifying glass unless you already have a good base tan. Oh my god, it just fried him. Oh my goodness. All right, let's. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's <laughs> so yeah, this is stage four. I don't want to do stage four yet. I want to finish up over here. And they they might just be numbered this way. Uh, there may not be individual worlds. This might just be one continuous thing. So we'll have to find our own breaking points uh, between videos. Just pick it up, Zach. There you go. So let's see what's down here. A couple more bananas. Uh, you know, getting the bananas are good. I can buy more, you know, better equipment, which I probably will do before next episode. I'm still trying to solve this puzzle, though. Okay, so this is... Uh... Oh, okay, yeah. So clearly we have... There you go. So this is the blue switch, which puts those down. Maybe this puzzle isn't as complicated as I was expecting it to be. I thought them switching was a bad thing, but it's actually a good thing because it allows us to get the blue switch. Okay. Hey, bird. So there we go. We got another art piece, and then also um, another torch lights up. And then we got to figure out where those other blues were. Uh, looks like it might have been over here. Oh yeah, here's one. So let's see what's what this is all about. Oh yeah, that's supposed to be right here. Hmm. Well, okay. I think I think the lesson here maybe is this. There you go. And I think that this will work. I don't know what the other thing's about. Oh, you know what? Yeah, I see what we got to do right now. I push this. Then I push this. Then I can just walk out there and hit the switch, so. Perfect. Now, I don't know if this is gonna get me a key or anything, but this is gonna be fun, regardless. So there we go, that's the yellow. The yellow one goes down, that, that's a path for me. So let's see about that path. Oh, I'm just down here, oh, here's another chest. There we go. That's a scroll, Shipwreck Cove. Okay, so we got one more piece of art. Let's see what we can do. So this goes up here. This is a little baffling. Oh, no, no, not so much anymore. There you go. Let's go down here and collect these bananas. I have a lot of bananas. Okay. So then we hit this. This gets it onto the path. Which uh, we did not have the luxury of it being on a path before, so... Now we can freely push it into the purple. Like so. Excellent. Alright, and then we open this up. That's the spirit right there. Tropical Ziggy. And then that's the uh, fourth torch. And we can go get the big chest over there. So let's... Uh, <laughs> I'm still laughing about the rabbit that's like evaporated due to the magnifying glass. I guess evaporated is a nice way of saying it. He probably just fried to death. All right, then we get this. And what is in here? We seem pretty happy about it. Oh, it's a rune. Nice. So we can upgrade our characters a little bit more uh, by following the skill tree. Very cool. Well, um, I think we're doing pretty good. I, you know, we, we know where the next stage is, obviously. Uh, we still have more puzzle pieces yet. I, I haven't quite figured out what these puzzle pieces are all about. Uh, so we're gonna probably, you know, figure that out. But next episode, we're gonna go 
And we're gonna do stage four. So we done we did the first three stages today. Um, I think that's pretty good. Uh, if I you know if I find out anything new, maybe I'll just come back and do stage four. I don't know. But I'll see you next episode. Until then, thanks for watching. Come back next time for more. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other awesome videos. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Join my Discord. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop.